So in this problem, we're asked to differentiate the function f of x, which equals sine of x times the ln of 3x. And so in order to solve this problem, you need to know what the derivative of ln of x is. And the derivative of ln of x is just uh, 1 over x. And you just got to memorize that for later problems. So I'm going to rewrite this as two different functions. So I'm going to call sine of x h of x. So h of x is equal to sine of x. And then I'm going to call this other function um, g of x. And g of x is equal to the ln of 3x. And we're going to use the product rule to solve this. And the product rule tells us we need these things. So we need h prime of x and we need g prime of x. So what is the derivative of sine of x? The derivative of sine of x is cosine of x. And then, then we need to find the derivative of ln of 3x. So we got to use the chain rule. So the ln of 3x, the derivative of it, is uh, the derivative of our outside with respect to our inside. And then we multiply by the derivative of our inside. So the derivative of ln of x is 1 over x, but instead of x, we're going to have our inside, so 3 over x. So 1 over 3 over x times the derivative of our inside, which is the derivative of 3x is just 3. So this is going to become 3 over 3x. Uh, and you can simplify that, but I'm not going to because we don't need to. So g prime of x is equal to 3 over 3x. And the product rule tells us is that we have like f of x. The derivative of f of x is equal to h prime of x times g of x plus h of x times g prime of x. And so let's just solve it. So f, f prime of x is equal to h prime of x, which is cosine of x, multiplied by g prime of x, which is the ln of 3x, plus h of x, which is uh, sine of x. I circled the wrong thing, sine of x. And then g prime of x, which is 3 over 3x. And so this is going to be the answer to this question.